just need your help for a sec. Those things don't look steady. They're not. Be careful. Excuse me. Yeah. Welcome to Avery's neighborhood. It's a nice place. <laughs> if you don't mind some structural problems and some water damage. Yeah, clearly some drainage issues. <laughs> a real fixer-upper opportunity. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so... Looks like somebody blew that dam and then flooded the whole place. You know, I forgot. Pretty good at this. All right, so which one of these do you think is Avery's? Uh, my money's on that one. The one that's still intact. Ah. Oh. They're not so bad at this either. Yeah, well, you know, I had a little practice. I read a few books. Shit, no. shit. What? What? The front door. Sam. He's still alive. Yeah, for now. Come on. All right, keep your eyes open for shoreline types. Yep. There goes nothing. Whoops! Sully told me about this place. I was picturing wooden shacks and simple homes at most. Yeah. Through here, watch your head. Ooh, someone had it in for this guy. Oh, another old note. Dragon. We're in Christopher Condon's house.
Tengo. One man? Jesus, I think that's it. You okay? Yeah. What goes on? <clears throat> uh. <clears throat> Might be a way through this cave. Yeah, it's worth a look.
How many people did you bring here, Nadine? She does have an entire army. You think they found the treasure? Well, let's hope not. For Sam's sake. Uh. Look, something here. It's addressed to Richard Want. Signed Adam Baldrige. They were both founders? the pop. Here we can climb up. After you. Oh, how sweet. You want me to be your decoy? No. Just being gentlemanly there. I <laughs> just busting your chops. <laughs> Yeah, well, the chops are plenty busted already. Thank you.
That wasn't too bad. You okay? Yeah. I'm fine. You? Well, wet again. Tired, bruised. Oh, hungry. I could eat. Other than that, fine. <laughs> yeah. Okay, come on. Let's keep going. Come on. Let's try cutting through this house. Yeah. I'm right behind you. You think the colonists flooded this place? Well, they definitely had the motivation. But you don't think it's them. I just find it odd that all these houses are underwater except for one. Avery's. Exactly. Cannons look like they were retrofitted. Yeah, improvised defenses. Guess they didn't expect they'd be fighting each other. Guess not. Ooh, nice water feature. Time for another swim, I guess. Over there, that looks like an exit. Right you are. <laughs> whoa, whoa! Stronger than it looks. Weigh it down for you. Great. Okay. You're welcome. Thank you. you make a great counterweight. Uh, I mean. It's okay. I'll choose to take that as a compliment. As well, you should. Find a way up for you. This should work. All right, stand clear. There you go. Hey, Greg.
right. Let's move this out of the way. Yep. Thomas II sigil. So we're in his mansion. Second in command. Going up the pirate hierarchy. Good lord. <laughs> Looks like we found the party. Looks like we're a little late. Hey, Nate. Check it out. It's another sigil. Oh my god. What? It's them. Elena, these other pirate captains have founded Libertalia. What the hell happened here? Well, I'm no forensics expert, but I would say... Bad drinks? Apparently. So, what was this? Some kind of... Wealthy pirate suicide... Cult? <laughs> yeah, not likely. Not these guys. On behalf of Lord Avery, I invite you to my manor at sundown tomorrow. The time has come to abandon our animosities and reunite under the banner of God and liberty. Signed, Thomas II. What do you bet? Thomas II, Henry Avery. Looks like our hosts didn't stick around to clean up their mess. Well, that wasn't very gracious of them. Okay, so... So these guys sparked a full-scale revolt when they claimed the treasure for themselves. Now, they took care of the colonists, but then they had to deal with each other. And I'm guessing things got pretty messy. So, Avery and Two invite them up here to, um... Uh, what was it, uh... Abandon our animosities. Abandon the animosities. Avery makes a grand toast. For God and liberty! Arg, ahoy, mateys, all that. <laughs> and they all take a swig. Except these two. And just like that, all the treasure of Libertalia becomes the sole possession of two men. <laughs> these are some of history's greatest pirates, and they all perished in an instant at this very table. It's incredible. Yeah. I'm, I'm sorry, I, uh, I'm sorry. It's okay. So, since our missing hosts aren't here at Two's Manor... We should head over to Avery's. Yeah. Let's go. There, for posterity.
Hey, up here. Slowly. Right behind you. Be careful. Uh, oh, oh. Ah! I'm okay. I got it. I'll meet you up top. More cannons, just like a two's mansion. I guess the poison is mightier than the cannon. What? You know, because he ended up poisoning. Yeah, it was bad. Sorry? Yeah, pretty bad. And we are officially inside Henry Avery's house. <laughs> Word of the day. Ostentatious. So why didn't he kill Thomas too? Was he like his right-hand man? Yeah, that's exactly what he was. <laughs> Can you imagine taking orders from a paranoid psychopath? This sounds like my first job. <laughs> what, the producer on your TV show? No, my manager from Macho Nacho. You worked at a Macho Nacho? It was a high school job. Did you wear one of those hats? The point is, my boss was a paranoid psychopath. He was the manager at a Macho Nacho. Just watch it, okay? Look, Shoreline barricaded the front door. And left a bunch of muddy footprints behind. Let's see where they went. Hmm. Footprints. So, where are all the shorelines? Elena, check it out. The footprints go through this door. <clears throat> Crap, it's blocked from the other side. Why bother barricading their path unless. They found something. All right, help me push this open. Yeah.
Jesus. You all right? Yeah. They were just waiting to ambush us. Yeah. All right, let's get that door open. See what they didn't want us to find. Okay, here we go. You ready? Oh, hello there. What is it? It's a letter. Signed by... Avery. Really? Read it. My loyal subjects, as the sun sets on our glorious paradise, we must endeavor to preserve its riches. The traitorous, too, knows our secrets, so we must act quickly. Destroy the dam, cleanse New Devon. Here we go. Uh-huh. And move my treasure through the passage to my ship. Two and Avery turned on each other. Are you really surprised? I guess not. Here you go. Thanks. Let's go find that passage. There's no more footprints. They end here. Okay, so where did they go? Let's look around. Sam's lighter. Did he drop it? Yeah, on purpose. Whatever it is we're looking for has to be somewhere around here. There's gotta be another way out of this room. Maybe that passage Avery mentioned in the letter. But where's the switch? Maybe this is a switch. No. I wonder if... Nope. This could be, but it isn't. Here we go. Damn it. Nate. Yeah, did you find something? I think so. Figured that out for us. How did you do that? There's a bloody fingerprint right here where Libertalia should be, and I pushed it. Nicely done. So the letter said that Avery was moving his treasure to the ship. Yeah. Do you think the treasure's still on the island? I think, uh, I think it doesn't matter anymore. Here we go. Careful, Nate. It 
Watch your head. Yeah. <sighs> oh. Looks like Avery built himself a panic cave. <laughs> yeah, I wonder where this goes. <laughs> Guess we're gonna find out. This place doesn't look very stable. Haven. Look, fresh footprints. They must have come this way. That's a lot of footprints. Let's take this slow. Crap. Okay. Money's on Nadine's men. They'll use any excuse to use dynamite. It has to be pretty dumb to keep it in here. Yeah, they're pretty dumb. Whoa, whoa, hold up. So, some kind of death trap? Uh, yeah. But Sam and the others somehow made it across. We just gotta follow their lead. Ugh. Just don't go where the footsteps aren't. <laughs> what? I'm just a little preoccupied with not blowing up right now. And unclench. Whew. Lena, look. Footprints stop here. They must have made it through and it collapsed behind them. Hey, just gonna move this out of the way here. Yeah. Damn it. I'll have to find another way. Oh no. Just hold out a little longer. Crap. Come on. Damn it. Hey, you still have Sam's lighter? Yes. Good idea. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. Of course he used it all up. Smoked like a goddamn chimney on the boat right over. Relax. I brought some matches. You did? Of course. There we go. Oh, sorry. Just one sec. Hello? Over here! Ow! Oh, Ow, oh, that's my head. Over here! Thanks. Glad you came prepared. Somebody had to. Come on, let's find a way forward. Nice romantic lighting, huh? You have a funny idea of romantic. <laughs> hey, this looks promising. Boost you up? Yeah. Come on. Huh? <clears throat> okay, uh, there we go. Uh, <clears throat> okay, come on up. <clears throat> okay, thanks. Watch your head. Yeah. Careful. <clears throat> Whoa. 
What the hell is this? This is creepy. The hands that stole from me. Wow, Avery's not even pretending to be sane at this point. I don't like this place. Me either. Let's get out of here. Hey, look. Avery had some gibbets left over. Gibbets? What? It's pronounced gibbets. Are you sure? Yeah. Well, no one likes to know it all. Wait, is that? You okay? I think so. What was that? Trap. Avery really didn't want any trespassers down here. All right, watch your step. Me? You're the one that stepped on it. Fine. Watch my step. Hell. God damn it! Are you okay? Uh, so far, so good. Maybe I just stay a little ways back. so many parts of this passage came in. Jesus. Avery's decorated this chamber, too. More human mobiles. that go boom. Damn it! Hey! Damn it, more mummies. Don't explode, okay? Just careful. Explode, okay? to breathe. <sighs> Nate, are you okay? Fine. I'm fine. I wish I brought earplugs. Am I yelling? Nate, careful. Yeah. Man, Avery's gone all Egyptian. Except this mummification wasn't, you know, voluntary. Footprints go this way. Be ready for a fight. 
No, I always am. Wait, is that a, in reference to me? No, would you calm down? You calm down. These guys weren't paying attention. There's no sign of Sam. We'll find them. Elena, get down! You idiots trying to bring the whole place down! I appreciate Avery's exploding mummies. <coughs> Let's go get those flares. <coughs> Good idea. The mouths that spoke ill of me. I hate to see this guy's Christmas tree. I don't see any footprints. We must be on a different route than the others. All right, let's see if we can catch up. Why, hello. Hey. So I guess this loops around? Guess so. Jesus. This was one of Avery's guys. Dead men tell no tales. Looks like a fight broke out. Yeah, two's men versus Avery's. Excuse me. <sighs> Hello. Some kind of key. What's that note? Oh, right. It's, uh, it's from two to his men. Hey, we 
can use the key to get out of here. That's good. Hmm. There's some symbols on the back. Well, let's go find a keyhole. You gonna explode now? Huh? No? How about you? This guy had some serious trust issues. Whoa. Oh god, oh god, oh god! <coughs> oh god! You done? Moves. <laughs> Thank you. Quite as creepy as all the hanging bones. Still, it's a little creepy. Yeah, maybe three out of ten, though. I'd say four. Really, four? Mm -hmm. Oh, my ears just popped. Yeah, we're definitely descending. Yeah, no footprints to guide us. The symbols match the ones on those posts. <laughs> Two showed his men how to get past the traps.
Okay, we're off to a good start. Follow my lead, okay? Just be careful. I'm always careful. <laughs> Says the guy who set off every mummy bomb in this place. Well, no, not a lot of experience with the mummy bombs. Thank you. So far, so good. Yeah, knock on wood. Better not. It might be rigged. <laughs> yeah. There. Made it. In your face, Avery. <laughs> That's our way out of here. Oh, God. Are those the rest of Jews' men? Yeah, gotta be. We know Avery likes to make an example of his enemies. He definitely likes making exploding mummies. <laughs> yeah. Let's, uh... Tread carefully in here. <sighs> Keyhole? Key. Wait, it could be a trap. We really don't have much of a choice. Oh boy. But I have a good feeling about this one. Huh? Do it. Okay. <laughs> you see? <gasps> well, at least we didn't get blown to bits. Oh, shit. You didn't bring a knife by any chance, did you? No. Oh, but that guy's got a sword. Here, help me swing this thing. Just like old times, huh? Lena? Lena? Hey! Hey! Lena, come on! Lena! Uh, my hero. Oh, no, you didn't do that. <laughs> no! That's not funny! Oh, oh you have done much worse. No. God, you gave me a goddamn heart attack. Oh. Let me listen. Sounds good to me. Uh, you realize we're now even for everything I've ever pulled, right? Yeah, like ever. No, not by a long shot. <laughs> <laughs> Gosh, you've got mud everywhere. <laughs> Anyone ever tell you you have a funny idea of romantic? Yeah. Yeah, I may have heard that somewhere before. Good talk. Good talk. Let's 
got to be Sam. Come on. At least the gunfire means he's still alive. For now. Is that a galleon? Yeah, sure looks like it. Ship graveyard. Looks like we can get down this way. Yeah, it looks safe. It's about as safe as anything on this island. Closer to them. Oh, crap. Look, that's Sam. He's surrounded. Yeah. Come on. We gotta go get him. I gotta find a way to the beach.
okay enough. Now let's find your brother. Yeah. We can squeeze through here. Okay, now where did Sam go? You wait this way! Huh? Good answer. You're a sight for sore eyes. Yeah. How about we get off this damn beach, huh? Absolutely. Did you find my lighter?
and liberty, asshole. Yeah, it sounded better in my head. Nice work, kid. Yeah, thanks for the assist. Come on over. I'll get you out of there. <laughs> Please. Good to see you, kid. <laughs> right in the nick of time. Yeah, well, got a little antsy waiting around to hear from you two. Oh, no, we gotta find Sam and Elena still. Hey. 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 Are you okay? Yeah. We heard those explosions, we thought. Yeah, that's all this guy. <laughs> <laughs> you saved his ass again? Naturally. How are you doing? Good. Good. There were some close calls, but, um... He covered me. Hey. Hey. How's that? Oh. <laughs> Bullet grazed my shoulder. Uh, you? Cliffside grazed my face. So how'd you lose Rafe? <laughs> he led his crew right into one of Avery's traps. Smart. <laughs> hey, hey, look. About the whole Alcazar thing. Hey, just, we gotta save that for later, okay? Yeah. Which way? On the beach, other side of this town. Okay. Good, I hope all that ruckus didn't attract any attention. Whoa, 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 whoa. Sorry. What are we doing? What do you think we're doing? We're getting the hell off of this rock. Right, we, we, we could do that. Or we could head in that direction, which is a shortcut. Shortcut to what? To Avery's treasure. <laughs> oh, wow. I mean, Rafe's got to go all the way around, but we can hey, just... screw Rafe. Hey, Victor, with all due respect, maybe just... You just this... don't know when to quit. Look, we're all here for the same reason, right? Right? We didn't come after the treasure. We came after you. And I appreciate that. I, I, I do. But we're good. And we've got the lead for now. <laughs> we can do this. Nathan, come on. Huh? Look around. Okay? Avery scuttled every last ship on this island. You know why? Because he was hell bent on keeping his treasure. Exactly. No matter the cost to the others around him. <sighs> because he didn't want anyone to follow him. Because he was leaving. Look at this. Okay. I found his map of the island. Okay? That's his ship right under that mountain. That's where our treasure is. And it is exactly where Rafe is headed right now while we stand around here and argue like idiots. What if he's already left the island and his ship sunk somewhere out there in the middle of the ocean? Then we find out where it got sunk. Oh, boy. How long we've been chasing this thing, huh? You and me. No offense to these guys. But they don't get it. Actually, Sam, they do. They really do. Okay. And trust me, they've seen this kind of obsession before. <sighs> Sam. We're not those kids anymore. We're not. And we got nothing to prove. Victor, where's that plane? Right this way. Is it far? Not very. Oh. Just through this port town. What if Shoreline set up an ambush by the plane? They didn't. What makes you so sure? Because they're heading to the mountain. For the treasure. This way. There she is. Drop. How did you get here? Yeah, I hopped down a few of these walls, but I guess we'll have to find another way around. <laughs> wow. 
I jumped down from up there, but it's too high to get back up. Yeah, maybe there's something we can put under it? Give me a hand, Sam. All right? Hey, you need a hand? Hey, no thanks. We got it. Hey guys, through here. Whoa, check that thing out. It's like a sky rail or something. Think it still works? No controls, but I bet I could pull the platform with my rope. What the hell are you doing, kid? Uh, I'm not sure yet. Maybe if you could get to that wooden platform now. <laughs> Getting there. I can't wait to sleep in my own bed again. So close, so far. I got an idea. Nathan, give me a hand. Okay. Okay, Victor, can I borrow you for a sec? Sure. All right, go ahead, Nathan. Made it! Here we come. Got it. All right, hop on. I'll pull you across. Okay, we're ready. Well, this is some impressive engineering for a bunch of pirates. This is nothing. You should have seen the elevators. Whoa! You guys all right? Yeah. It's like a roller coaster. Come on up, Nick. Right, Nathan, you climb on up. I'll grab you. Go! Jump off, quick! Nathan, give me a hand. Jump up. Sam! Bitch. Sam, come on! Come on, just jump, I'll catch you. Let's go. No. No, no, don't you even think about it, you hear me? I'm sorry I got you into this. All of you. Hey, all of that doesn't matter anymore, okay? Just, just jump. I gotta see this thing through, Nathan. Sam, hey, listen to me. If you do this, I'm not coming after you. You hear me? I'm sorry. Sam! Sam! 
I called you bluff. He's gonna get himself killed. Come on. She's, she's probably right. Of course she is. Let's go. Up here. Maybe we can head him off. I'm gonna save him, and then I'm gonna punch him. All right, let's just worry about the saving part first. What the hell is he thinking? I mean, after everything that we... Wasn't this enough? Let's just find him. Get over that wall with this. Come on. Here, we got you. You ready? supposed to get up there we don't have enough time Nate no not by yourself Look, I'll come right back okay Look, he is not gonna leave without a fight yeah, well then I'll fight him if I have to but either way I'm bringing him back just get the plane as close to the mountain as you can and be ready for a quick getaway like there's another kind it's not fair Doing the dishes, we take turns. Don't even think about not coming back. <laughs> I love you. Same to you, cowboy. Sure, he's a ways off by now. Just gonna head to the creepy mountain, save Sam, get the hell out of here. Yeah, be laughing about the whole thing tomorrow. Back on the trail. The footprints end here. 
Come on, which way did he go? Back on the trail. Footprints in here. More footprints. Well, you didn't fall to your death, so that's good. Still get a chance. To... Christ. More footprints. Well, you didn't fall to your Footprints. I still get a chance to kill you. Jesus Christ. this. <clears throat> oh, it's Burns' grandson. Close, but no cigar, pal. Almost at the finish line. Got the best of you. Go. Hey, Sam. Uh, 
Oh, there you are. Sam! Oh, Jesus! I swear, Sam, if Rafe and Nadine don't kill you, I just might. So much harder than it looks. I can do it. Oh, shit. Oh, 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 crap. I made it. I made it. Oh my god, that's Avery's ship. All right. No oh, shit. I was too close. I guess this is my way down. my way down. Do all that, Sam? Uh, I doubt it. Probably found the dry way down. That's painful. Way down.
Nee. We're almost done here? This is the last of them, ma'am. Good. If we are here, we can catch up with the others. <sighs> Sam just stole our goddamn boat. He's headed for Avery's ship. Come on. Let him. We're done. We're done? Most of my men are dead, Rafe. And those who aren't have already left. Can you see that? The end is literally in sight. That maniac pirate of yours has rigged this entire cave. I'm not setting foot on his ship. Nadine, if you cut and run right now, the loss of all your men, everything that we've done, is for nothing. We have millions in gold right here. I'd say that plus our lives is something. No wonder so many of your men abandoned you. Excuse me? We're on the verge of making history here, and you're willing to just walk off with a pittance, a fraction of what Sam's gonna get from that boat. If he can walk away from that ship alive, he can have it. Hell, I'd say he's earned it. God knows you didn't. Now look, we can stand here and insult each other all day, or we can finish what it is that we've done. Oh, we're finishing it all right. Sorry, ma'am. Thing about mercenaries, Nadine, their loyalty, it's bought. It's not earned. Now come on. Either we can finish this thing together, or we can just end it right here. Let's go make history. And a girl. By all means. <laughs> I need to get out from under this dock. Let's see what you have in store for us, Captain Avery.
Look at that. There's your treasure. God damn. Nate? Where is Sam? Oh, he's right there. Sam? Relax, he's alive. This idiot nearly got us all killed. I'm getting him out of here. No, you're not. Rafe, you can have the treasure, all right? Just let me save my brother. <laughs> <laughs> After everything he's done? How noble of you, but no. We stay here any longer, and we're all dead. Is that what you want? It's not what I said. What do you think, Nadine? <coughs> Good to see you up and about. Be a deer and relieve Nate there of his gun. Hand it over. You really think you can trust him? Huh? Not your concern. Now, why are you trying to instigate? Nate? Nadine and I are our partners. I don't screw over my partners. Get over there. You and your brother, though. Right from the start, you took advantage of my generosity. You tried to cut me out, and it's high time you learned. What are you doing? Now you give me your gun. <laughs> Nadine? I won't ask you again. You are being profoundly stupid right now. Look over there. Nadine, stop screwing around. Jesus! I said look! Okay, it's a couple of skeletons. So what? I don't know as much about history as you boys, but I've got a pretty good idea who those two are. Well, enlighten us. It's Avery and two. They killed each other. Good for them. What's the point? Everyone obsessed with this treasure gets what they deserve. So what, you're just leaving us here to die? Oh, I'm just leaving. Whether you die or not, I don't really care. Nadine, wait. So long, Rafe. Nadine! Nadine! You open this goddamn door right now! Rafe, she's gone! Come on, give me a hand, we'll all get out of here. won't work. Come on, help me with Sam and I'll help you open the door. No, I'm not going to be able to enjoy one of these coins. Knowing that you and your worthless brother are still sucking here. Just, just calm down. You can practice your fencing when we get outside. Nate, just shut up. Seriously, Rafe, this is insane, even for you. You want to hear insane? Nathan Drake raced a madman and his entire army to the steps of Shambhala. Yes, Jesus. Nathan Drake found the lost city in the middle of the Rub al Kali desert. God damn it. Come on, we can get out of here together. Nathan Drake discovered the fabled El Dorado. Come on, Rafe, stop. Nathan Drake. Is a legend. <laughs> you know, I, I shot the man who told me that. Look, I get it. You don't like me very much. You know, for all your greatness, Nate, you have nothing. You are nothing. And I warned you to get out of my way. Sacrificed everything to find Avery, and I'm not gonna let a couple of stupid thieves, a senile con man, and a washed up journalist take that away from me! You care about that parade of losers so much? 
I'm going to make sure they join you. On guard, dickhead. That's the spirit. You know what? the inevitable. My arm's getting tired. Underneath all the bravado, you're just a sad little boy with delusions of grandeur. Who, by the way, can't fence for shit. So long, Nathan Drake. Nathan!
I earned this. All of it. You want the treasure, Rafe? It's all yours. <laughs> Get you out of here. It's too heavy. Strike it. It's no use. Try again. It's no use. Come on. Take this. Damn it. Listen to me. Listen to me. All I ever wanted to do was find this treasure with you. Hey, sure. Sure. We did it. We did it, brother. Okay. It's all right. There's gonna be another way. Nathan, you gotta go. There's gonna be some. I gotta go. This tough. There is no other way. Come on, Nathan. I gotta know you made it out all right. No. Nathan, the whole place is about to blow up. That's it. That's it. The hell you don't. It's stressful. God damn it. Let's get your head down. Yeah, I think so. Yeah, feel free to sell anything I left behind. <laughs> sure, I can't give you a lift home. After the last few days, I think I'd like a plane with drink service and reclining seats. Plus, uh, she and I have a lot to talk about. Yeah, you do. And no more late night phone calls about one last time. <laughs> Promise. Thanks, Sally. Take care, kid. Don't be a stranger. Next time you're in town, beers are on me. I'll hold you to that. <laughs> and then the bunny escapes anyway, and it leaves little bunny surprises all over the headmaster's bed. Hey, 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 what are you telling her? Just about your little magic phase. Oh, I hate you. What was your stage name? Go on, tell her. Nate the Great. <laughs> it's not funny, it makes sense. In his defense, he was actually, you were pretty good. Uh-huh. Mm. Hey, look, Sam, it has been an experience getting to meet you. 
But the handshake? What? Bring it in for the real thing, sister. You take care of this gnome skull, all right? Yeah, I will. I'll join you in a sec. Yeah. I like her. God help her, she sure seems to love you. <laughs> I know, right? Listen, the offer still stands. I appreciate it, but I'm good. I know, but if you feel like you're imposing, it's, you're not. We not talked about, about it. It's not about that. It's a little bit of that, okay? Yeah. But I just kind of thought that after we found Avery's treasure, I'd be satisfied. Uh -huh. Instead, I've uh, <laughs> kind of left with this strange feeling of emptiness. Yeah. Yeah, well, you know, as thrilling as the next adventure might be, in the end, I always left with that same feeling. And sometimes you just gotta choose what you're gonna keep and uh, what you're gonna let go. Well, I guess I'm just not there yet. And besides, you know, you've got a few ancient cities on me, and I can't let that slide. So. Yeah, I left a couple out there. Well, thank you. <laughs> oh, that's, that's our ride. Yeah. Uh, Sam. Come far. We sure have a little brother. Come here. Listen, you don't do anything I wouldn't do, all right? Get out of here, Vemus. <laughs> What's next for you, hmm? Hmm. <laughs> well, before I got dragged into this, I was working on a business deal of sorts. Of sorts? Hmm. Dangerous? Yeah. With these people, yeah. It's up there. Well, I just so happen to know a certain someone recently out of prison who might be perfect for this kind of work. Ooh, I don't know. Is he trustworthy? More or less. As is Portuguese. Quando seu marido volta para casa? What's that mean? How long before your husband gets home? <laughs> That'll do. Come on. You got any more of those cigars? Don't push your luck. What's going on? Land a big contract or something? Oh, even better. I'm on the verge of selling Jameson Marine. No kidding? Yeah. Wow, that... Well, hey, I guess, I guess congratulations are in order, huh? Oh, well, not yet. But I'm confident it'll go through. They drove a hard bargain. But in the end, I think we came to a uh, mutually beneficial agreement. That's, that's great. Are, are you going to stay on? No, 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 no. I think I'd like to just relax, hang with the family, go fishing every chance I get. <laughs> Good for you. <laughs> so who's the sap who's gonna buy this place? Oh, uh, you are. <laughs> what? <laughs> no, come on, seriously. Oh, yeah, seriously. <laughs> wait, Jameson. Hey, wait, wait up, man. Hey, morning, guys. What are you doing here? Just thought I'd take, you know, one final look. Already gave your husband the keys. Okay. Perfect. Is, is this for real? Nate, all you need to know is that you'd be making a very wise investment. Do the right thing here. Call me when you're through. You got it. Hi. Hi. You're, you're buying Jameson Marine? We are buying Jameson Marine. Oh. Okay. How? 
Why? Well, I heard this rumor about a salvage job off the coast of Malaysia, and I thought it'd be right oh, up our no, alley. No, Honey, look. We barely got out of the Britannia alive. Yeah. Hey, taking an illegal job? You know what that leads to. Who said it was illegal? <laughs> look. This came in this morning. Is this legit? Yeah. Some of my old contacts out there, they worked their magic with the Malaysian permit office. <laughs> it was great. I didn't even have to bribe anyone. Well, that's good because I don't know how we could possibly even afford to do this. Here. Hold out your hand. What? Hold out your hand. Come on. Holy crap. Where did you get this? It was in my jacket pocket. Along with a bunch more. A bunch? Sam. He's a sneaky <laughs> one. Yeah. Of course, most of them are gonna have to go into our venture here. Along with all the new camera gear. Camera gear? Yeah. You know, I figured as we're pulling all the cargo up from the dive, we could hire, you know, a small crew. We could film the whole thing and resurrect my old show. What happened to just living a normal life? I think in our attempt to lead a normal life, we may have oversteered. Look. When I was on that island, I missed the adventure. I missed us. And so now we have a chance to do what we love. But from here on out, we are gonna operate on a strictly legal basis, all right? And I will be doing all of the shooting with my really expensive camera. Wow. You've really thought all this through, haven't you? More or less. But listen, just say the word and I will call the whole thing off. What? No, 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 no. I, I don't want to be that guy who ruins Jameson's early retirement like that. That'd be cruel. Right. <laughs> it's not going to be easy, you know. Nothing worthwhile is. So, what do you say, Nathan Drake? Sure, why not? Hmm. Yeah, as long as I don't have to do any paperwork. <laughs> well, I can't do it. I'm gonna have my hands full with the camera. Well, I'm gonna have my hands full with all the diving. Okay, fine. We'll take turns. Yeah. Or... I could play for it. Seriously? No, listen, I have been practicing. I'm getting good. No. My hand eye is way I better than it used to be. Really? <laughs> I cannot do that to you again. Are you afraid to play me? I am so You're not. Afraid on a to scale play of you. one to ten, how scared are you to play me? Like a three. Yeah, well, jack that up to like eleven, all oh, right? Because uh, I'm coming for you. Oh yeah. Yeah. Oh my that's Okay. Fine. You're on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
Where are they? Mom? Dad? Anyone? Yoo-hoo! I think they abandoned us. Go. Hey. <laughs> Off she goes. Taj Mahal, here I come. Just a few more weeks. Ah, perfect day. Now all we need is the rest of our boat crew. And not here either. Okay, I guess I'll just wait then. Got the search area narrowed down quite a bit. Keep in here. So goofy. Hmm. He left his keys. He left his keys. There's no way. It's just no way. A Spanish doubloon, but from where?
16th century. Where is this from? Kinda creepy. Kinda cool. Hello. Gunsway heist? Wait, did you go looking for Avery's treasure? No way. Is that Dad? Parvis Magna. Greatness from small beginnings. Huh. What's this? What the hell? Oh shit. Hey, there you are. Hey. Been looking for you. What are you doing in here? Uh, looking for you guys. Come on, we loaded up the boat. It's ready. Cool. I'll catch up with you guys in a sec. Why? Uh, I just need to, um... Uh, What's get... up, Cassie? Okay. Don't be mad. I said, don't be mad. Keys. So, what did you see? Nothing really. Well, just that photo of you two and Sully with a bunch of Spanish looking treasure and a shotgun. This is bound to happen sometime. Maybe we should just tell her. She's not ready for it. Ready for what? All that crazy shit in there? Language. Yeah, language. Sorry. But you guys are literally keeping skeletons in your closet. Or at least a silver skull of some kind. You know, I don't think I'm ready for this. Really? Nate? It's time to have the talk. Mm. Yeah, it's totally time. Wait, which talker are we talking about here? She's just a kid. She's older than you and Sam when you started That's, all of this. That is different, and you know it. Okay, look, if you guys were into some shady stuff, it's totally cool. <laughs> but I think I'm old enough to know about it, right? Old enough? How old are you again? Ah, <laughs> funny. Mom? All right. Well, let's see, um... For me, it started when this guy called me up with a scoop on a massive historical find. <laughs> it sounded like a complete fraud. Yeah, handsome fraud. No, I hadn't even met him yet. Oh, she knew. <laughs> she knew. So this fraud says, if you fund the trip, then I'll give you the coffin of Sir Francis Drake. And for the record, I totally delivered. Yeah, you delivered us into the hands of Indonesian pirates. No, oh, come on, you know I had nothing to do okay, with that. Okay, guys, time out. You're saying that you were attacked by pirates after you found the coffin of Sir Francis Drake. Is that right? Yeah, yeah that, pretty that's pretty much right. it. Yeah. Bullshit. Language. Language. Crap. Better. All right, so keep going. 
You know what? The sun is up, boat's ready, wind is just right. You want to continue the story? I say we do it on the water. Come on. But, well, wait, what would Francis Drake look like? Was it gross? Actually, he wasn't in there. Yeah, just his journal with a map to El Dorado. The city of gold? That's the legend. Turns out it was just a statue, a cursed statue. No way, seriously? Yeah, seriously. But uh, well, I'll get back to that later.